Hello everyone, I am Pragati Bansal and I welcome you all to Jaipuria Institute of Management Lucknow. I am thrilled to welcome you to our esteemed institution and today I will be sharing some tips and some tricks with you all which will help you in your 2 years PGDM journey and beyond. So here we go. Tip number 1. Embrace continuous learning. Make use of the most of the time you get in those two years. You not only need to build your reserve of knowledge, but you need to attend seminars, you need to attend workshops, be part of the task forces of various events, be it OJAS, Mashal, Talash, interact with mentors, faculty, students, staff members and build your strong network and create that bond. Let's talk about the tip number two. You need to foster a growth mindset. You need to have a mindset that will help you grow both personally and professionally. For this, you don't only need to capitalize on every opportunity that comes that way, but remember to embrace challenges and view every failure as a stepping stone. Each and everything that happens in your life is a learning lesson. You all need to remember that success is not just about grades or having an A+. Plus. It's about building skills, creating a positive impact and having an all-rounded relationship. Let's talk about the third tip that is to build a strong network. You are coming to a B school and the foremost requisition for any candidate is to build a strong network. You need to connect with your peers, professors and other professionals based on your area of interest. And mind it, you can also seek the help of your mentors while deciding the area of your interest at Jaipuria Lucknow. Not only that, when we are building a network, this is not only a learning experience but it will help us to have connections which will embrace and leverage the opportunities for a lifetime. Let's come to the tip number 4 that is to prioritize tasks. Coming to a B school, you might feel overburdened sometimes with the academic pressure or with other activities going around in the institute. But one thing which you need to make sure is to be able to prioritize tasks because you don't need to do any task just for the sake of doing it. You need to do it effectively as well as efficiently. And the only trick to do that is to learn to say no to distractions and do what really matters is important to you. Because this prioritizing of tasks will not only help you to be organized, but will also lead to a positive work-life balance. Now let's talk about the last, but definitely not the least, tip number five, embody professionalism. Coming to a B school and stepping into the corporate world, there are certain tips and tricks which you always need to keep in mind. First and foremost, be punctual. Then you should dress up appropriately as per the occasion. Most important thing is to have a positive and a growth mindset. Next you need to try to cultivate effective communication skills both written and verbal. On that note, mind it to ensure active listening because communication is a two-way process. And lastly, respect your seniors, peers, faculty, staff members or anyone who is around you. So my final message to all the wedding managers out there. Life is not a game of luck. If you want to win it, work hard, but most importantly, work smart. So as you embrace on this exciting two-year roller coaster journey, remember to believe in the me that believes in you. And one small secret message, don't forget to enjoy these two years at Jaipuria. You are never going to get this time back again. Thank you.